portion of the Acura NSX. So what we got here on display today, we have the second gen NSX media information. So if you go to the Acura website, you can find all of this information uh, that they released. So I'll just share something briefly, the history and innovation of the Acura NSX. When the original Acura NSX made its debut over 25 years ago, it forever changed the sports car world by combining exotic car styling and performance with a new dimension of quality, exceptional ergonomics, and dynamic poise. The NSX introduced and defined Acura's approach to precision crafted performance with its cutting edge design and innovative technology that provided exotic car performance for real drivers in the world. So in this document, there's a lot of information pertaining to the NSX, but we'll skip all of that and get right to the discussion today. So we're going to go ahead and scroll through here and get started on the power unit of the NSX. So here, the NSX operates off of a V6 engine coupled with three electric motors and so the twin motors are in the front of the vehicle so let's talk about the power unit the all-new acura nsx sports hybrid super handling all-wheel drive power unit electrifies all phases of driving whether accelerating braking or cornering so there's the information right there so that you understand how this unit work. The twin motor unit contains two independent electric motors that support every phase of driving. The TMU provides an active front drive force at any moment, can be accelerating, braking, or working cooperatively to rotate the vehicle based on the driver's throttle, brake, and steering inputs. A lot of engineering went into this, okay? A lot of engineering. So let's go ahead. We're going to jump down to the next section here. Talk a little bit more about this power unit. So the way that this thing has been designed, again, we've got the twin motor unit that sits up front, two electric motors in the back, coupled with the nine speed DCT transmission, the twin turbo V6 engine. We've got that direct drive motor in the rear. So the NSX driver will experience peak performance from the sport hybrid super handling all wheel drive powers unit marriage of mechanical and electrical components working as a system to provide instant and linear acceleration. Okay. So when you are in that launch mode and you're pushing on that gas, you got that thing engaged it moves. Why does it move so fast? Because you've got that instant torque from those electric motors. Okay. So let's go ahead. We'll jump down now into the next segment. So here, so now we're talking about this direct drive motor. The direct drive motor is packaged between that twin turbocharged V6 engine and the transmission and it provides additional torque and power to assist the rear wheels okay so to eliminate the response delay typically associated with turbocharged engines the direct drive motor acts directly on the engine's crankshaft which together with the front mounted tmu helps the nsx realize immediate high output, and high torque acceleration. The effectiveness of this design is particularly noticeable when accelerating from standstill at low engine speeds. So there you have it. This is a hybrid, but the purpose of that hybrid setup is not so that you can cruise around town and push a button and drive in hybrid mode all the way through, but it's designed to give you that instantaneous torque right when you're launching from a standstill you get that instantaneous power 
All right, so the last piece we're looking at here, the twin motor unit, okay? So we're looking right here in this section here. The instant and linear acceleration of the new NSX coupled with outstanding dynamic capability is enabled in part by its front-mounted TMU, designed to be as small and lightweight as possible while delivering ample torque and power and precise torque vectoring to the front wheels. The TMU provides supplemental power in conjunction with the twin turbocharged V6 and direct drive motor for instantaneous acceleration when desired. All right, the TMU can dynamically apportion its torque to create a yaw moment, enhancing cornering performance. Finally, the TMU recovers braking energy during deacceleration to supply power to the hybrid battery. So there's your hybrid component right there. Okay, and the last section here, the last section here. Okay, I think, yep, that basically is it. But this document has everything in here um, to explain the engineering behind this. Okay, so the lithium iron battery pack. So let's talk about that real quick. Packaged within the IPU is a lithium iron battery pack that stores the electrical energy to power the TMU and the direct drive motor. The high put lithium ion battery pack consists of four modules, each with 18 individual battery cells contained with a specifically designed caseless structure that utilizes the vehicle body itself for a lightweight yet sturdy housing. Based on the latest advances in lithium ion battery technology for automotive applications, both the positive and negative electrodes have been optimized for increased energy, density, and efficiency. Again, a lot of engineering went into this um, the design of this. So here in the last piece here, you can see on this graph, the direct motor response here. You can see the traditional, uh, supercar on this graph here. And when you look at the NSX on this graph, you can see that instant G. Okay. So they put a lot of work into the design of this vehicle. That's all we got for today. Wanted to share that information with you. Hope you were able to learn another aspect of the NSX. For now, this video's done, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.